Whoa, now what's happening with you boys out there? So check this out, man. I'm about to show y'all some cool stuff here. Right here, I call these my speed loaders, my magazine loaders. You know, whatever you want to call them. But I got some you probably never seen before, man. You probably seen them. I don't know, man. But they, they off the chain, bro. They really off the chain. So check this out. I'm going to start off with these right here. The first one I'm going to show you is the U-loader. This is the U-loader. It's made by Padovich. Made in Ukraine. Patent pending. This one right here does the AK-47 and the AR-15. So what's so cool about this one is, say you got an AR mag, you can put your AR mag in here, bam, load it up. You got an AK-47 mag, you can put your AK-47 mag in there, bam, load it up. So I ain't gonna lie, this one right here is the only one, these two right here are the only one that could do two different magazines. So that's pretty cool. This one got the up and up right now. This one got the up and up. It could do two magazines. All right. And, and, and the cool thing about this is, so what you do is, I'm going to show you a little later, but you load your bullets up right here, and then you just push them in. And it tell you, you got 10 bullets, 20 bullets, and 30 bullets. So you know what you're loading up. So you could just put them, like, if you just need 10, drop them right there, boom, push them in. And whole mag, 30, boom. And then it tell you, where the 7.6230 at and the 5.5630 at. So you go by these lines, these measurements of these lines right here. And that's how you know where your 20 and your 10 and your 30. And this one right here is the same one. I had a Black Rambo version way back in the day. I don't know if y'all saw it. It had maybe like a million views, man. It was crazy. But I had a Black Rambo version. I think they gave me this one for uh, New Year's. On the 4th of July, I mean. Same thing. You know, hey, I can't lie though. These things are very sturdy. It's very strong. Check it out. I like how it's made. I like the my favorite one is the wood one. They made me a black, all black one with the black round bow on the back. But I like the wood one. So U loader. That's cool. Let's put those to the side. Let's put the U loaders to the side. Next, we're gonna pull out this. Now. I got this. I got this from my homeboy. This one right here. So, I don't even know the name of this. I just remember one day, me and him, we were at a uh, gun show. And so we saw it. And the dude showed us and we like, oh man, we got to have it. Because I'm so tired, bro. You can't tell me you don't get tired of just taking a magazine and pshoo, pshoo, putting one in, pshoo, putting one in, pshoo, putting one in. Pshoo, put, man, they get, man, all your fingers start hurting. It's not hard. But, man, if you could get something to make it do faster, why not? You know, uh, duh, I would. It ain't like I'm in no rush in, in military war going to do something, you know. I've been to war, so I should know. We don't use these in war. But, anyway, so the way this works is you open this one up. Slide it back. You get you some bullets. So you sit your bullets in. Stand them up. Close it back down. Well, I'm guessing this be up here. Yeah. yeah, I'm guessing this up here. Right? Yeah, my fault. Open it up. Load your bullets down. And you put your magazine in, like so. Like so. And then you just slide it down. Vroom! And they all go in. So that's cool. But I think this one might take longer to because you got to pull this off. Uh, you know, uh, you got to pull this off, reload it, stand it up. So I like this one. It might take a little longer. Let's see who makes this one. Magazine loader. Do you got a name? Well, I see right there. Insert mag. It's very easy. Pull lever. It's bonified, I tell you that. Not complicated at all. All right. Now, forget all that. Let's get to the grand finale. Now, I forgot to tell y'all, these right here, they come with a dope little bag. They come, come with a little bag. Come with a little sling in it. <clears throat> so, that's pretty cool. I'm not going to lie. 
That's one of my favorites when I'm at the range because I could just pull this out quick. Boom, just lay the bullets. And see, I could just lay my bullets right here and just slide them. Here, vroom, slide them. Vroom, vroom. And this thing's like a magnet. It gets stuck right here, so watch. When I go like this, watch. I got it. See, it gets stuck. It gets stuck. So, this is a good one right here. I'm telling y'all, this is good. Good, good, good magazine load, especially at the range when you need it. All right. But these right here? Nah, these right here. This them beasts is right here. Oh, let's get to these. Right here is called the Mag Pump. So, this one, let's do this one last. Let's do this one. Right here, Mag Pump. Now, this one is off the chain. So, what a mag pump is, is, check it out, the fastest, easiest way to load magazines, right? So, this one right here. So, what you do is, you put your bullets in here. It don't matter which way. It could be up, the, the uh, projectile could be pointing this way, the projectile could be pointing this way. It don't matter. You just drop them in, as <laughs> long as they're straight, all right? Put them in there. All you do is pump this down. You put your magazine in there. All you do, like so, is pump this down. And you can see the bullets. You can actually see the bullets in here. Flipping from side to side, going in right. It's crazy how this works. Because one bullet might be pointing this way, other bullet might be pointing that way. And you can see them while I'm pumping. While I'm pumping, you can just see the bullets going in right. Then you pop it out, full magazine. Now that thing load fast. When I tell you fast, real fast. Now this one right here is for my, which one this is? What do they say? Five, five, six, two, two, three, and three hundred blackout. So that's what this one's for, right? When it breaks down, you can take all this off. If it, if if one of them kind of get messed up in there, you take this off, shake it out of there. I never had no problems with it, so I can't really say nothing about it. So I actually have three of them, and I love them. So once I get me a bigger house or something like that, I'm gonna uh, bolt them down to like a gun room or something like that, and it's gonna be dope, you know. I got them on standby, you know. You know, you know, you know. But check this out, homie. Bam. Got one for the AK2. 7.62. Bro, I'm telling y'all, man. I'm not going to tell you nothing wrong, man. I'm not going to tell you nothing wrong. You got to go check these out, bro. This will save you a lot of time. That will save you a lot of time, man. I'm not going to lie to you. And look, and I'm guessing, I'm guessing y'all wondering, well, I got a pistol. I know ain't no way... They could just do, he got a Glock, he got this, he got this, he got a Kimba, he got this, he got a CZ, how, how I'm going to do all that. That's why I saved that one for last. That's why I saved that bad boy right there for last. That's the reason I saved that bad boy for last right here. Just to get with y'all, you heard me? Just to get with y'all boys. So check this one out. I love this one. Now this one is dope. I'm going to tell you why it's so cool. So I got my Glock one in here right here. So this is the pistol one, right? So you put your bullets in here, and you can see the little thing jumping. Wait up, I'm pushing it down hard enough. Let me see. Yeah, I'm pushing it down. Oh, I ain't pushing it down hard enough. But you can see a little thing jumping in here. Boom, 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 boom. When they're going in, boom, boom, boom. I'm talking about you just drop, drop your bullets in there, man. You just drop them in there. And just go to pumping. Just go to pumping, you heard me? Go to pumping. Go to pumping. And you're going to see, you see, uh, you can see the bullets in this one, too? Yeah, you can see the bullets slide down here in this one. And the cool thing about this, now, check this out. Now, all right. So this one is for a Glock, all right? And they have a whole bunch of different ones. So if you have, let's see, hold on, let me grab one. So, so Glock, if you have a Smith & Wesson, if you have a Sig, if you have a Sig, if you have a CZ, a CZ, a Ruger, and what else? Springfield. So that's the ones that I work with. I don't know if they have more. I've been having this thing for like two years now, so I don't know if they have more. But the way you take it off is it's very easy. You see this? They squeeze just a little bit. Just a little bit. So you squeeze it. Come off. Bam. Squeeze it. Well, I'm using one hand for the camera. It's really easy, but 
It's really easier than this. But I got one hand right now. I'm by myself. And there you go. Smith & Wesson. It's ready to load up. Bro, I'm not even going to tell you nothing wrong. These things are off the chain. So what I'm going to do, since I'm by myself, I'm going to figure out a way to rig this darn camera up. I guess I'm going to use that, that box back there and set them up. Because the thing about these, you can't do them on the ground. Like, with these magazines, look. Like, look. Which one is this? That's 7.62? Yeah, that's 7.62. So, like, with these magazines, if I load it in here, right? Let's see, I load it in here. I could do that one. But the AK one? Oh, my AK mag. Let me get that brown boy. Let me get that brown boy, you hear me? The AK mag, it ain't gonna, it ain't gonna go. See, look. It ain't gonna go. It's gonna have a little buck in it. It's gonna have a little tilt in it. So I'm gonna set all this up, all of them, and I'm gonna show y'all how these boys work. From the cheapest to the most expensive. Yeah, I'm about to run them right now. All right, so I'm gonna start off with the U loader. So the way the U loader goes, if you got your bullets, just your little bullet tray. Your bullets just sit right here. I really like the U loader. It take a little time, but it's not bad because you got to straighten your bullets up. And you go down. And sometimes you can, if you're good, you can just throw them. That's three, five, eight, I mean seven, nine, ten. So ten, look like it's a little bit behind the line, but I guess ten is right there. So let me load it up there right quick. Ten, twelve, thirteen. Some people probably gonna be like, oh man, I would have been loaded a magazine up by now. No, you wouldn't. Shut up. Stop lying. Stop lying. No, you wouldn't. Shut up. So let me see how I can hold this for you boys while I load this up. All right, here we go, y'all. Let's see, I'm gonna rig it up. Bam. Boy, I'm good. Yeah, by myself. So the way this goes, you hold it. It's a little hard right now because I can't. There you go. And that's it. It would have been easier if I wouldn't have the phone between my legs holding it up, but that's it. And this one does 7.62. And it does 7.62 a little easier because it got a little notch right here and it fits in. So with this one, you got to kind of hold the magazine when you're sliding it with the 7.62. If it's in the notch, it's going to just stay there. So I'm about to load that 7.62 up next. Bam. Y'all saw that, right? That was pretty fast. All right. I got my 7.62. 7.62 magazine. Same thing. It would have been easier. I'm telling you. If I could use my hands like I want to. But, you know, I make it do what it do. Y'all saw that. I just loaded up, what, 60 rounds with my phone in my hands? Come on, man. Real easy. Bam. That's the U loader. And this one right here, this one right here do the same thing as this one, just a different color. But that's the U loader, y'all. On to the next one, right? Now, I know y'all loving that U loader. Because I'm loving that U loader. You heard me? All right, we got this thing next. I don't know the name of this thing, so I'm going to call it thing. We got this thing right here. This thing right here. That's what we're going to call it. This thing right here. So, all right. This right here takes... See, this is what I don't like already. Got to put the magazine in. I wasn't even thinking. I used to like this one when I first saw it. But then it's like, all right. It's a little cheap. And it's a little hard. But it works. See how more complicated this one is than the other one? I got straight up standard bullets in there. Then they're hard to get in there. You see that? And this one only for two, two, three, five, five, six, and 300 black. I don't believe it. But let's put a couple more in here. I'm gonna load it all the way up for you. Man, I haven't used this. I haven't used this thing in a long time, man. Look at that, man. 
Act like you don't want to get up in the hole, you heard? Get up in there. Come on. Bullets embarrassing me up in here. Come on, get in there. I can get one more. I ain't even count, y'all. I ain't even count. So look, I'm thinking that's four. So we four. We close it up. And this one, they're easy, watch. They in there. They in there. I ain't gonna lie, it took a little while to load up, but this thing don't play no games. They don't really play no games. Not bad, not bad. Not bad, thing. Not bad. That's what I'm gonna call you, thing. This thing don't play no games. All right, so we got the mag pump. I turned my flash on because I gotta, y'all gotta see this. So I'm gonna load this mag pump up. So check out how I load these bullets up. All right. It don't matter. It don't matter. See how they face in different ways, right? I don't like how they did this. I ain't gonna lie, I like this, yeah. I like this a lot, yeah. I ain't gonna lie. It's, it's, it's dope. I don't know if I'm gonna load it all the way up like this. But you see how the bullets just face in different ways, right? You see how it's facing different ways? I got one in there. Let me take it off. Take it off. Put them in there. Put about five more. But they got to be straight. They can't be like all crossed like that. They got to be straight. And they got a little pump right here. See, they got a little pump. That's why they call it mag pump, y'all. Duh. <laughs> but look, let me set my phone up again. Let me do my little cameraman work. Now, you see, you can see it on the side. Right, so I'm gonna set my phone up so I, you can see when I'm pumping. All right, boom, you got it. Now you see which way the bullet facing? You see which way the bullet facing and stuff? So watch when I pump it. Oh, let me put the magazine in, I'm sorry. Magazine in. Oh, my little 350 box ain't strong. I bet you're wondering how it's doing that, huh? I bet you're wondering how it's doing that, huh? Okay, I'm reloaded. Yeah, mag pump don't play no games. That mag pump a dog. You can't tell me that mag pump ain't no dog. Now I'm going to load that 7.62 up for y'all. I'm going to show y'all. Same thing. Same process, man. Same process. All right. You see I got them 7.62s in there? Same way. All kind of ways. They load it up. And I think I put that 40, 40 round mag in there. It's that 30 round. I put that 40 round mag in there. Got me 10 more up in there, you heard me? 10 more, you dig? So I'm going to set this one up the same way. I'm going to set this one up the same way. Let's just see how it come out. You see him? I wasn't on this box, it'll be even easier. If I wasn't on these Yeezy box, it'll be easier. Come on down. It must be four. It must be four. See when they do that? When they do that there, it's four. Boy, mag pump, you, you you can't tell me that thing that don't cut up. That was 40 rounds quick, right? That was quick. And you want to see when I pump it? Let me load some up in there and show y'all a couple. Let me show y'all a couple right quick. Let me show y'all a couple. Right quick. Let me show y'all about two or three of them. I got the Louisiana hands. I'm good. When you pump it, this how it's looking. You don't see me. All right, let me do that Glock when it go down and shut it down. Let me do that pistol when it shut it down for the day. Go back to sleep, man. All right, and for the Glock, same rules apply. Same rules apply. It don't matter how it is. 
Got grass and stuff. Now nah, I need to clean my closet. I'm gonna have to shampoo. I need to put wood in here. Just drop them in there. It don't matter. If you ever have any problems, say you have one of these, and one of them so happen to get stuck, all you gotta do is pull these out and get it from out of there and fix it up. But I never really had that problem. But let me show y'all one more time. Mag pump. Here we go. Shaking out the top. I think I'm full. I think I'm full, y'all. Yeah. I think I'm full. Yep. There you go. Watch out. Pull it. It's a little hard. Uh -uh. Pull it. And that's it. Mag pump. Same rules apply. Just put a different one in there, man. If you had a different type of magazine, squeeze this out. If you had a uh, Springfield, I got a Springfield in the room. I could go get it, but I ain't about to. There you go. But look, which one y'all think the fastest, man? Huh? Which one y'all think the fastest? I'm loving that mag pump, though, baby. Yeah, Black Rambo, rock with your boy, man. Go subscribe. Yeah, go like my videos. Yeah, I appreciate the love, man. 100, man. Real, recognize, real. Mm, I'm out. So I forgot to tell y'all about this. This is an easy way to unload it. This is by mag pump, too. But I, only, I think I only have the 7.62 one. Don't mind my dirty floor, man. This is my gun closet, man. I got to clean it. But the way you do this, look at this. I haven't done this in a while. Other way. Oh, other way. There you go. Snap it on like that. And watch this. down so if you ever want to unload your magazine fast that's 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 fast i ain't gonna lie but i know a faster way <laughs> letting them loose